we're talking about the orders of operations. And the orders of operation tells us how to work out an expression so that everybody does it the same way. So first we have parentheses, exponents, multiply, divide, add, and subtract. Now, if you only come up across these four, the multiply, divide, add, and subtract, you always do work from left to right. And that'll be a little bit clearer in the next example we have. But here's just to start. We have 27 minus 18 divided by 6. Now, according to the orders of operation, the first thing that we do is divide 18 by 6. And I know that that is 3. So I rewrite the expression, 27 minus 3. And then because subtraction is the only thing left over, we just figure it out. The answer is 24. That one's pretty simple. Our next example is a little bit more complicated. But you can still figure it out. 36 minus 18 divided by 2 times 3 plus 8. Now, according to the orders of operation, we should always do multiplication first. But in this case, we're going to do the division first because it comes first in the expression. So we're going to rewrite the expression. 36 minus, now 18 divided by 2 equals 9. So we'll put 9 there times 3 plus 8. Now the next thing that we do is the multiplication. 36 minus 9 times 3 is 27 plus 8. And then we just work it across. 36 minus 27 9 plus 8, which equals 17. That one's pretty easy, too. Here's one with an exponent in it. 5 plus 6 squared times 10. So according to our orders of operation, we're going to do the, one, the number with the exponent first. So we get 5 plus, and this means 6 times 6, which equals 36. 36 times 10. And then we do the multiplication. 5 plus 360. And then we add that together. 365. They can get a little bit more complicated, especially when they have different brackets. So here's one with a bracket and a parenthesis. Don't worry, you guys can figure this out. 4 plus 12 divided by 4 minus 2 to the third. Now the first thing that I would do when I see this, I would look at this exponent. Because exponents is one of the first things that we do. But don't we're not going to do that. Because it's outside of the bracket, that's going to be one of the last things that we do. So the first thing that we're going to do is the parentheses. And within the parentheses, we have a division problem. So we're going to go 4 plus 12 divided by 4 is 3 minus 2, and don't forget the brackets. Now we're going to do what's in the parentheses. 7 minus 2. 7 minus 2 is 5 to the third power, which equals 5 times 5 times 5, which equals 125. So that's how you do the orders of operations.